Let's build this easy cow farm that makes over 400 steak and 200 leather per hour. We will create this module, which consists of a waterless breeding cell to prevent excess noise and an auto-killing collection chamber. It can be placed in your world however you like. For the bedrock players, click on the bedrock section of the video. On screen is a list of required materials. The note blocks are optional, and the amount of filler blocks is just a recommendation. Build time. Start by placing a dropper facing upward, and place a wooden pressure plate atop it. And then the redstone, as you see here. Make sure the observers are looking downward, with a solid block on top of either. This circuit will automatically keep the pressure plate powered, which acts like a 5 minute pulse clock. Now place four front-facing dispensers. Place down five non-flammable blocks and one glass block above the redstone torch. Place two chests down beside the dropper, and three hoppers going into it on either side. Place trap doors on every hopper. This will prevent any lava from flowing down and killing the baby cows. Now we'll place a two high wall around the killing chamber. I'm using glass, but it could be any non-flammable. Then we'll come over here, jump on the chest, and put a glass block. And then on top of that, place any non-flammable block. From here, throw one filler block onto the pressure plate, and fill up the dropper with the rest of your filler blocks. The more the better, as these will be used to keep the timer running. Now simply access the dispensers and put one lava bucket in each. Place six temporary blocks like so, then go ahead and place the rest of the trapdoors as you see here. Break out some of the temporary blocks and cover up the killing chamber. Add four blocks in next to the trapdoors, and place four stairs off of those blocks, with their backs inward to the farm. Then add two upside down stairs so we can access the chest and the dropper from the breeding platform. Optionally, you can add in two note blocks to notify you every five minutes, which is the same length as the cow breeding cooldown. You can add a variety of blocks underneath to change the sound of the note blocks. My favorite being gold and packed ice. Let's now bring the cows into the breeding area. Depending on where you built it, you may need to build a staircase up. You will want to breed up to 24 cows. Once they are full grown, you can go ahead and break out two blocks and open the side trap door so that the babies can fall down from now on. All you need to do now is breed up your cows when you feel like it, and the babies will fall down and automatically burn when they grow up, dropping steak and leather into this chest. Just make sure you add junk items to the dropper every so often to keep the timer running. Each item in the dropper is equal to 5 minutes that the timer is working. So if you completely fill it, it will run for 144 Minecraft days non-stop. If the timer does run out of items, simply refill the dropper and throw a block onto the pressure plate to reset the system. Did you spot Perry the Pink Sheep? No. Oh, <laughs> you're not subscribed. Let's fix that. Scroll down and make that red button gray, so that next video, Perry can reveal himself. On screen are the materials needed for the bedrock version. Start off by placing a repeater, facing away from a block with a pressure plate on top. Place a block down on the other side of the repeater, with a redstone torch on the opposite side. Put a block atop the torch. Place a repeater on the third setting, facing away from that block. Place a dropper facing the pressure plate, and put however many filler blocks you have inside. Place down three blocks around the pressure plate. Throw a filler block onto it, and then cover it up. Place an observer looking down at the repeater. Then place a dispenser atop the observer. Put down two chests with a hopper aimed at them, with a trapdoor on top. Place a glass block above the chest and non-flammable blocks on the other sides of the trapdoor. Place a trapdoor on the column above the chest. Then add another dispenser, facing the same way, with a block on top. And again, raise the columns except for the chest column. Add a trap door, then place stairs as such. Then add a button on top of the highest block. And add three more stairs upright. Then add in the lever, which can block off or allow calves to fall through. Make sure you add water into the top dispenser, and lava into the bottom dispenser. Optionally, you can add note blocks to the build, to give a little chime on a five minute timer, which is the same cooldown as cow breeding times. Go ahead and add in your cows. You can start to breed them up. After having bred the cows in the top chamber for a while, switch to killing mode so that subsequent breeds drop the babies into the killing chamber. Their drops will fall into this chest, which you can access from the surface. Just make sure you add junk items to the dropper every so often to keep the timer running. Each item in the dropper is equal to 5 minutes that the timer is working, so if you completely fill it, it will run for 144 Minecraft days non-stop. You now have a sweet little automatic cow farm, so you can spend less time worrying about what you're going to eat, and more time dreaming up something awesome. If you want to save even more time, check out this video on wheat and crop farms. It has some really awesome mechanics. Not to mention, if you don't want to miss out on Perry the Pink Sheep's next appearance, I'd recommend subscribing.